Well, good morning. It's Sunday morning. Beautiful day. It's going to be hot though. Talking 90s and humid. A uh, little progress here on the 40. <clears throat> on the uh, nose piece here, I got everybody's comments. Thank you. Uh, I had a bunch of friends up here too, and they looked at it and they only gave me a bunch of ideas and tips, and there's many possibilities we can go with this. I have to put the pictures on uh, Facebook and see what those people say. I haven't gotten that far yet. But I think it's going to go. I think we're going to do it. I mean, uh, I might weld up the seam, get rid of that. One of my friends said I should scallop it a little bit more, give it more of an effect to it. You know, it's a whole bunch of ideas and I'm putting it all to good use. But thanks again for all the comments. Uh, what I've been playing with is the exhaust system. It's one of those things I hate doing, but usually get stuck making all my own stuff. I get a flex pipe right off the header. I'm using a V-clamp. I don't know if you guys can see that in there. It's kind of dark. But I got the driver's side done. Got a cute little cherry bomb. Figured I'll take out some of the ringing. Otherwise, it's, for the most part, it's three inch all the way out. It's a two and a half inch cherry bomb to give it a little back pressure. And it exits out right here. Kind of neat. <clears throat> I'm going for loud and obnoxious. That is the goal. Because why well, have a hot rod if it ain't loud and obnoxious? And I'm piecing together the passenger side at the moment, so I figured I'd give you a shot of how I'm going about this here. Just tack together. I gotta readjust a couple things. You can see the flex pipe right there. That goes to my header and my V clamp. So that's where we're at. I'm just about out of my supplies of diesel down pipes and diesel exhaust. When I worked for a diesel performance shop, they would always, you know, chop off the exhaust systems and put big monster Anaconda pipes on so they'd throw this stuff in a dumpster. I took it home. And all three inch mandrel bent, you know, it's stainless steel. Can't see that going into the garbage. So I pretty much made all the exhaust on the mat rod with that and the orange peel with that and my dad's dump truck made all exhaust with that and used it on a 40. I'm just about out. So I'll start buying this stuff and that'll suck. But that's later down the road. <clears throat> so that's where we're at.